so the camera button switches between the front camera and the quadcopter's camera okay first the image from the quadcopter was very black I could see only the contours of objects and I had to use these two buttons to make it look nicer this one creates a video that one creates a photo and is displayed on the top left corner of the image that it's recording and you can connect the micro USB cable there it says USB no LED is lighting up anywhere the battery does not need to be connected it's off and in file explorer that Panasonic just appeared that is the micro SD card and of course you can access the files those are the video files AVI and JPEG in the beginning I was not on the correct channel or something like that and these were the images you can see some contours of objects but it's not clear at all and then it was fine picture is 640 by 480 it's a small picture and the video file is also 640 by 480 25 frames per second and 16 megabits that's pretty good for such a small file audio is mono 128 kilobits I'm not sure why but the audio was this one it's just a noise it's not a sound okay and if I disconnect the mini USB then this should disappear yep the entire file manager disappeared so you don't need to take out the memory card to access your files you can copy them to the computer just by using the micro USB by the way buttons are clicking while I'm pressing it from this side so this rubber thing is not comfortable at all here at the nose Now to mount this we have to take care of these small elements these are holding this plate and they have to go behind these okay when you want to remove it just pull it outside a little bit outside and it comes off let's try this foam and it's not in the center you can see it here also this portion is larger than this one oops I guess you cannot reposition it anymore I just broke mine file transfer speed from the goggles onto the computer through the USB cable 7 megabytes per second okay now the computer's graphics card is connected to the HDMI output to the goggles because that one it's an HDMI in here it's an input okay and now I can see my own computer's desktop in the goggles you can see that's the taskbar and pressing the windows button that's the start menu 
Can I zoom in even more? I can't read those texts. Vegas Pro Adobe Premiere Pro Okay, through the camera is not working easily, but if I press the Windows button, see the start menu appearing and disappearing. 